Hi everybody, Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith welcoming you to this big game today. It's Burnley today against Manchester City. A big game this for Burnley. Got to be pleased with the way that they've played so far and the position that they're in, Martin, mid-table. Nobody really expected that and I don't think they did. They can keep things going in this fashion. It's going to be a successful campaign for them. Every time I see Sergio Aguero, he seems to do something extra special. Well, he's loving this competition. Really is scoring for fun so far. Bernie lineup. Tom Heaton starts in goal. Scott Arfield plays with George Boyd out wide. And it's good to see them going with two strikers today. Manchester City's lineup today. Claudio Bravo starts in goal. Pablo Zabaleta starts with Gar Clichy as the wide defenders. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Ilkay Gundogan in the middle. Sergio Aguero is the sole striker. Very few clubs in England have the depth of history that Burnley Football Club have. Having got to the Premier League for a campaign, 14-15, they're relegated again. Probably finding it hard financially to compete at the very highest level, but never underestimate what Burnley bring to the game generally. Great people, great town. It's only a town, and uh, it's amazing that they have such support. It is amazing. You, you walk into the ground and it's almost a throwback. It hasn't been modernised a great deal, but you get that old-fashioned welcome. It's an invaluable quality to have as a football club. Sergio Aguero. And carrying the ball forward, it's the Manchester City. And here's the shot. Didn't hit it cleanly at all. <laughs> strong challenge. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. It's Burnley pressing on. Kevin De Bruyne. Sergio Aguero. Attacking now. David Silva in the middle. And the goalkeeper, it's his ball. Here the challenge is a good one. Well, he clears the danger. All the pointers for the result go towards a Manchester City win. That is a tackle and a half. Gal Clichy. Silva. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. A timely challenge. Sterling. Well, this is great teamwork. The way they're knocking to put them in front. Good try.
comes in with a tackle. Not rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. And now the cross from David Silva. Sterling! Good work by the goalkeeper. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. And heads it towards goal. Good goal to take the lead here. What a strike that is. Well, he could hardly miss that from the right wing. That was a perfect delivery. And they got their reward for it. Well, it was the anticipation as well, wasn't it? Just to get in front of his man. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Goal for Kevin De Bruyne. Fernandinho. Good position, they've worked this attack very well. Into a quite a dangerous position now. Oh, and a possibility here. De Bruyne. And he scores spectacularly. Well, how long did that lead last, Martin? Not long at all, and the manager down there is absolutely furious. Came close to goalkeeper, actually did get a touch on it. But I think it was a pretty good effort to do that much. Well beaten, really. Yeah, I don't think you can blame the keeper, Martin. He's looking at his defenders. Why was the lad given so much space? So, away we go at one all. Manchester City goal, number 17, Kevin De Bruyne. Boy. On the attack here. Tackle here. And that will be a throw. George Boyd. Nicely played through ball. Gonna try his luck. And there's a score here. And that has significance because they're now into the lead. Manchester City are trailing now, they've got to try and hit back. Who would have thought Manchester City would be in this position late in the first half? Certainly given the pedigree of their players, it is a surprise, but given the pedigree of their players, they've got the capacity to turn it around. The fourth official has indicated... Three minutes to be added on. Three minutes. And the referee's seen it, handball. It's a fine goal, and we can see it again here. Yeah, and I don't think the keeper will want to look at this too many times because it's middle of the goal, it's, it's a decent height for him. Manchester City, now the side trailing here, despite having more possession, look at those stats. Yeah, it's quite incredible, really. They've dominated possession and dominated the match, but it doesn't show for anything. And he's headed it goalwards. It's in! Fine moment for them. They've got a firmer grip on the game now. They're two ahead. He is high and mighty with that goal. He was literally head and shoulders above everybody else there.
reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scoreline. That's uh, half-time now, and the score is 3-1. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. I would be happy with that first 45 minutes. It was a good goal from him, good overall performance, actually. now of the second half and this could be a really good move from Burnley working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal and here's the shot a oh, great work by the keeper it's a corner David Silva with a, an attempted pass that doesn't work out. Comes in strongly. Sterling. Manchester City going to make a change here. Manchester City are on the attack now. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Gundogan. Good defending. Stephen Defoe. Here's Gray. Looking for an opening with some good control build-up. Opportunity now. Credit for taking on the shot. But well, what a good chance that was for him. By his standards, that's a glaring miss. Coming onto the pitch. Number nine. We've reached the hour mark. Half an hour to go. Well, this attack got a bit of menace to it. And shoots! That's a very good goal. Oh, talk about a dramatic appearance there from the substitute. Brilliant goal from him. Well, they're on the comeback trail, Alan. Yeah, I can smell something in the air here. I think they can, because they look the team on the up now. Let's have another peek at that goal. Plenty of goals here today, 3-2. Arfield. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. And now the shot! He's kept it out. Pablo Zabaleta. Still 20 minutes to go. Looking to get the ball forward here. Manchester City. Manchester City piling men forward. Well, the time for patient short passing has stopped, I think. Because route one is the order of the day now as they load the box. Kevin De Bruyne. Very good passes. This team are passing the ball beautifully. To bring them level. Oh, fantastic goal. Well, what a game this is turning out to be. From two behind, they're now level again. 
He took it with greater plum. I'm sure getting the first goal gave him the confidence to grab the second chance here. Well, here's the goal again. Totally remarkable to get back to level pegging. It's a great team effort. Here's a chance to move forward from midfield after that interception. And carrying the ball forward, it's the Manchester City. Substitute is ready for Man City. No, Leto! No, no, no! Well, the defenders could only watch and pray because they'd been left for dead, but he just couldn't finish it. It's time for some fresh legs here. Stephen Ward. Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Oh, it's a foul, it's a penalty. Very late on now. Substitution for Manchester City coming off the pitch. Substitution time. To be replaced by number 19, Very neat penalty, goalkeeper no chance. Yeah, it is, and uh, he doesn't normally let you down from 12 yards, certainly didn't there. Manchester City are trailing now, they've got to try and hit back. You would not have picked this situation with a pre-match prediction, I'm sure. Manchester City in trouble now. With each passing minute, the trouble gets more and more serious. Good to have. Manchester City are on the attack now. Through pass. Just seen the board there. Going for goal! And the goalkeeper got a touch to that. Shots on here. Great work by the goalkeeper. Great hands. At the ref line, he's found a whistle, and it's finished 4-3. The side we expected to win have been given a huge shock here. Very unpleasant game for them. But the underdogs, no wonder they're dancing around the touchline in celebration. It's an amazing victory. It is, and give them credit. They took their chances when they came their way. And the defence, I thought, was spectacular today. What a brilliant performance from this fella. Well, so often we think of his creative abilities, but a couple of goals here won the match for his team. Well, as for the opposition, 
He set up a goal, not a big goal scorer himself, and uh, the team really lacked a bit of firepower. Really trying to use.